See? If anything, okay, if anything, it's reasonable doubt, whole bunch of it, you know? Mm-hmm. Personally, I think he's not guilty. That's what I feel. But you know what I'm saying? Uh, they hide so much damn sh- you know what? And it doesn't look like they're hiding it, hiding it for their benefit. <laughs> you know, it's not like they're going to get a benefit out of it, right? Yep. They're they're not. So I don't get it. Why would they hide evidence? Because it doesn't point in their direction. Okay. Um, actually, it's my wife. Um, my, my fiance. Uh, so this this sounds this sounds kind of crazy, but like I'm just kind of like I don't know. I I don't even know what to do right now. Uh, I I just I'm over here kind of I'm kind of going through it. Going through what? <laughs> well, well, okay. So once I, I don't think you no. Why don't you just go away from me? Because you're kind of creeping me out, dude. For real, <laughs> you got to get away from me. Okay, because you are really creeping me out. I do not get what you're saying, but you better just go. I don't want to hear your question. You better just move on yourself. Goodbye. Oh, Lord, have mercy. I don't know what that is about. Bye. Hello. <laughs> guys there did you hear that stuff Mm -hmm. let me tell you something this guy came up walking from behind don't know what he's doing he's putting a step up on the back of the bench here like he's gonna jump up and he's like just talking in circles Um, i kind of need advice from um a female stand of you and i'm like dude you better get down you know what i mean dude you're creeping me out got to go i I ain't worried about that i got chains i got it all you know what i'm saying that is just some weird stuff, dude. I, I, I said, what are you going through? What are you talking about? And he's like, well, I was going to ask you a question. No, you need to get away, dude. For real. That freaks me out. Yeah. That's what's nice around here, huh? Anybody watch that? I'm watching out the window. Boy, you got to go away. I'm like, you better go. <laughs> I'm sure that's... Yeah, he's not around. Okay. <laughs> I kind of put a damper on everything. Where is everybody? Then he still isn't back. Of course it is. My gosh, what do you think? <laughs> I'm sitting right by that door, Dad. You can't get in the front because there's chains, there's everything. It's pretty secure, you know what I'm saying? But this is yeah. like, a, there's like woods behind here. And he came from the front, but that was just too weird. I should have turned it towards him. I was just like, oh, no, you got to go, buddy. I'm grabbing my stuff. <laughs> I'm throwing everything on the top of my laptop, carrying it in. Because I'm like, I'm not. You better go. And he just kind of like stood there. But when he put his hands up on the thing, like he was going to jump up, that's when I said, oh, no, you got to go. <laughs> and, all right. Oh, you know, that's weird. No, I'm cool. I'm cool. Not worried about it, no. I got a stick in the door. He can't come through. And he can't get in the, the security doors. There's not security here, so I'm not worried about it. But I never had nobody do that before, and I've sat up there many a times, you know. That's the patio door behind me. So if he comes in, he'll be filmed. <laughs> so I'm not worried. That's cool. I can't find my chat, though. I got to get my... Hang on one second. I got to grab my stuff. Real quick. Play Jeopardy music or something. Okay, here's the coffee and my mouse. <laughs> all right. That was just weird. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. you'll, see, you'll, see all, you'll see all kinds of, you'll see me fight, I'll tell you what. I am not, I'm not worried about protecting myself. Really not. I mean, I think I could do an okay job at that, but. Two hours later. <laughs> With Linda and <laughs> Georgia. <laughs> Man, I'm going to be able to edit out all these parts from start to finish about Linda, like, getting yeah confronted and then this guy being arrested. Holy shit. Okay, I just, there we go. Sent it to you, Georgia. 
There you go, my kiddo. Oh my gosh. That's my daughter. She'll take charge. I thought and he's, gonna, he's gonna do it to somebody else. That's the thing. And if she's in an apartment complex, correct? Yep. So then there's multiple options for him. That's scary. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. I sent you the link in Facebook, sweetie. Oh boy. Wouldn't you have to stick with me to get some true crime, true happening now? Right? <laughs> stick with me, guys. Life is never dull. It is never, never dull. Right? <laughs> oh. Time to come back. Oh, my mother. <laughs> We're all typing. Yeah. It's like old school news. Remember, we go, hot news, news, hot news. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's that. Connecting. Okay. You got to push, you got to put your name in there, Georgia, and then put your name in and then push, uh, go, scroll up and you'll see enter room. And I think Denise has got to add you. Yep, I watch for her. Yeah, no kidding. True crime live. Yeah, Paul. My scary situation this afternoon, my daughter goes home and <laughs> she got some news to tell you. I'll read the lower in the chat. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Are you watching for her to come in, Denise? Because I don't know. If... Yeah, I am. Okay, because okay. I don't know how it works. I never did it myself. It's actually fairly easy. Unless you were me earlier this afternoon. It was not. Yeah, that's craziness. It would not let me in. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. Uh, Maybe I sent them wrong. I don't know. I just clicked on the same link I sent you. Is That should be good, correct? Yeah, the link. Yeah, the link that I sent. Yeah. All right. Okay. Because I, I was thinking maybe I sent it the other one. She got the guy that was disturbing me outside the patio door there, Paul. The stalker weirdo. Yeah, the creeper. No, I don't know who he was. Have no idea. The guy comes up and says, "Um, I, I, I kind of got um a, a situation." And I said, "Okay, yeah." And he goes, "Um, I may, I need a girl's opinion." And I went, "Yeah." And he went, "So I was over here, and um, and it, then he was like." making gestures to climb up over the balcony. And that's when I stood up and took it upon myself to say, ah, you're freaking me out. You got to go. <laughs> so I don't know. And then he said, well, I want to ask you a question. Well, if you wanted to ask me a question, sucker, you would have asked me that question five curvy talks ago. Right. So, I don't know what his intent was. Um, he left um, after he seen I was serious. Like I got all my stuff. He was still standing there. And I said, no, you need to leave now or whatever it was. And when he came in, then he walked away. I'm not kidding. It's like, and I never even thought, you know, but like I told Georgia, um, I usually get a, a good feeling about somebody or something, or maybe he was really serious and didn't need something. But no, this guy was shady as shade can get. He was trying to think of something to say to keep me there or whatever, oh, either to steal my laptop or break in the house. I don't know. You know, I'm sure he wasn't, didn't want to rape me or nothing like that. <laughs> but you never know. But anyway. Well, you, know, you never know. And I, it, he did not realize that you were actually talking to other humans. He probably thought right. you were just sitting there dicking off on your computer, you know. Right. Because, but if you got a question you need to have answered, you ask it right away. Or he would have said, no, 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 really, I need your help. I, I, and then, I, then I said, okay, I'd call the police or something, you know. There she is. Can you guys hear me? Hey, Norta. Hey, babe. Hi. Tell us what happened. Okay, so you guys are a little bit, I hope you guys can hear me, right? Yep. Yep. Okay. Oh, I was pulling into Walmart and I saw this guy with dreads and he like sat down, had a set like a little satchel on his back. And I looked down and I, he had red shoes and he just looked at like he looked really shifty. And that's when I was like, dude, Linda, 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 listen, Linda, listen. Hey, did he have red shoes? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to get your attention before I get out of my car. 
And I'm like, okay, dude, this if this is the guy, he's going to have some words. So when you told me he had red shoes, I was like, all right, dude, it's on. And I went to go record, and my battery is really low, by the way, so if I get caught off, I'm sorry. And my battery is really low, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to try and ask the Walmart cop because they have West St. Paul cops, you know, in the Walmart. So I go in and I asked the officer, I was like, excuse me, officer, can you come with me a moment? And he's like, yeah, what's going on? And I said, there's this gentleman outside and I don't know if he's strung out or what, but earlier today, a, a man very much like him approached my mother in my home. Okay. And I live on the first floor of the Oaks of Heatherwood up there. And he's like, yeah, I know where that is. And I said, okay, I don't know if you've had any reports about a person like, like going up to people's patios or anything like that, any break-ins or suspicious behavior, but you know, it really unnerved my mother and I want him to know that that's not going to be tolerated. And he's like, sure, just point him out to me and just, you know, stand, you know, stand by me. And I said, OK. And so I took him to the doors and he was sitting on the bench facing the opposite way. And I was like, that's him right there with the dreads and the red shoes. And he's like, oh, OK. And he walks over and as soon as he starts to walk over, kid starts trying to book it across the alley. So guy runs right across, tackles him to the ground, fucking arrests him. And I was like, I'm just going to go inside now because apparently running from the cops and being suspicious is a problem. So, OK, bye. Right. Well, so I went in and I did my shopping and I was like, cool, justice served. Well, then I walked back out and the officer was waiting for me and he's like, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't get an official statement. And I was like, it did not happen to me. So I don't want my words to be put in an official statement, but I will tell you right. that my sister was scared. She couldn't understand what he was saying to her. She felt like he was going to try and steal something. I have four daughters that live in my apartment, okay? All of them are under the age of 10, and they are blonde-haired, blue eyes, and I don't tolerate that shit. And if you ever came back to my apartment, I was going to whoop the crap out of him, to be honest with you, officer. And he's like, nope, you have every right to defend yourself on your home, and for him to run just tells me he's suspicious and, you know, just trying to talk to him and get, you know, his name has become a difficult thing because he's slurring. So I just wanted to thank you and see if I could get a statement. And I was like, hey, well, thanks for doing your job. Right on. Right, right on, girl. Glad so it, glad that's scary as there's that, right? Yeah, that's kind of scary, though, that you would run into him and see how freaky scary he was. Well, and that's, that's why I was so concerned. I was like, dude, what's going on? Like, is this really that guy is it that kismet that i would run into this guy i'm supposed to do something at this point yep i'm glad you did honey that's the right yeah. thing yeah that's well, amazing. I'm, not, not a taker. I'm a go-getter i don't tolerate that stuff i i will i always believe that you should be the change you want to see in the world and if you feel threatened by someone or you feel that somebody is off putting to your peace then you need to make it known on why they you know why or how they make you feel and how you can change that. And if they're refusing to change and they're going to continue about evil behavior, well, then guess what? There's a judge, a jury, and an executioner, and I can be all three of them. <laughs> yeah. But there's your update. Okay, guys, I got to get from Walmart home. I got to make some dinner, so I got to get out of here. But... All right, I'll talk to you guys a little later. Bye, honey. Bye. Be safe. Love you. My daughter did it all. <laughs> well, yeah, we, we can edit that video out and send it. You can go pick it to the place and be like, here, add this to her suspicious bullshit. Yep. <laughs> bye, Justice. Oh, no, he's saying bye to my daughter. <laughs> oh, my daughter. Well, here comes Linda and the tornado. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that is yeah. very bizarre, Paul. It is. It's kind of creepy, actually. I mean, yeah. You know, you don't really think like nothing of it, but it, like Georgia said, if he's, you know, hanging around and acting bizarre there too, you know, never know what he's up to. And if you're right. running from the police, you've got to be hiding from something. People just don't right. run if somebody's coming up to talk to you and you didn't do anything. You know, I don't know if people do. I mean, yes, people do make false confessions and all that. I get all that. But if you're just sitting there and you're not doing anything and have nothing to worry about, you shouldn't be running from them. Right. I, yeah, she's a good kid. I'm I'm proud of her. <laughs> Absolutely. No, just his body actions and what he was trying to think of to say. You know, you can kind of tell he was he didn't have a plan when he walked up there. You know. Right. But he was trying to get one and just the yep. little you know because he put his tab up there and then he put his hands there and he kind of leaned back like he was going to put his red ass foot up there. <laughs> and that's why I did notice his feet because mm -hmm. I was watching him and it's like oh no you act a little strange for me dude <laughs> a little too strange for me. You have got to go. Right. 
And at that point, I thought, maybe he's going to, my heart pitter pattered a little bit faster because I thought, well, maybe he's going to jump over that thing. <laughs> right. You know, wow, just wow is so right. 